You're watching Impulse on the Freedom Network. And now here's Anthony. Thank you so much for that introduction. Today I wanted to talk to you about this, the Razer Naga. This is a, it's an MMO mouse. And honestly, at first I was like, Hermit Gerd Nation, another geeky peripheral. But no, this is what every single gamer needs. Personal opinion, just saying. Just saying, I don't have facts to back that up. As far as mice go, I have found that this is very accurate. Um, the scrolling is very, very nice in the way that it handles that. We've got multiple buttons on this mouse that all do all kinds of crazy things, and I'll explain that here in just a second. The mouse features a 12-button mechanical thumb grip, which means that you've got 12 buttons all here at, the, at your thumb so that while you're playing, you can use these buttons to assign your macros and things like that. Of course, this mouse is Synapse 2.0 compatible, which means that you can pretty much take this anywhere, plug it into anyone's computer, set it up, and bada bing bada boom, you have all of your macros all in one place. It's awesome! The cord that it comes with is a very nice 7 foot cord. Um, and I say very nice because it is a wrapped cord that's going to keep it from getting, um, from getting tangled and knotted and you know, all those things that nobody ever wants their mouse cords to, to do. It's, it's very nice, it's a good touch. Honestly, it's one of a million things that give this mouse an air of professionalism, an air of quality, and it just overall good design. As far as other buttons on the mouse, of course, you have your standard left and right click, and you also have the, uh, the scroll wheel, which can be clicked straight down, also left and right. To some of you, you may not get that, but that is a really nice feature to have on a gaming mouse. It just gives you an extra two buttons that you can program to do whatever it is you want to do. Personally, myself, in League of Legends, I actually assign that to be slash J and slash D. For you non-League of Legends people, that's your joke and your dance for whatever champion it is you're playing. <laughs> that's just a really nice way to end a match. Of course, this being a high-end gaming mouse, it does have ultra slick feet on the bottom. I actually upped my game by getting a mouse pad specifically to use while I was testing this because my current mouse pad just wasn't really up to the task. But I actually found, even on my old mouse pad, I could totally tell a difference. Once I moved up to the nicer microfiber type mouse pad, I noticed a significant increase in my ability to, you know, kick butt. All in all, I give this mouse a 10 out of 10 on everything. And it's hard, really, really hard for me to send this back. But unfortunately, it's a review unit and I have to. <laughs> Razor, you have my address. This mouse overall, it's just really well designed. It works. And I don't mean that in a mechanical sense. Of course, mechanically it works as well. However, it just, it is. It feels like an extension of my hand. In fact, without me even trying, my hand has formed to the mouse while I'm shooting this. I, I'm smitten. You can pick these things up at your local Target, Walmart, or your local electronics store, I'm sure. They usually run about $50, $60 or so. Do you have any experience with Razer products or the Naga in specific? If you do, let us know in the comment section down below. I would love to talk to you about it. If you found this review helpful, also let us know in the comment section down below and uh, we'll, we'll have a nice little conversation. We'll talk about things and, and whatnot. Game. This is one of those headsets that it may not look like much, but there's an old saying about judging a book by its cover. But this isn't a book review. If you judge all your secrets, if you really look at yourself, you would be speechless. What happened to being doctors and teachers? What happened to being your brother's keeper? Nowadays, kids more worried.